Commander involved in strikes on Ukraine shot dead in Russia. Here's a summary of the article. Cookies, device identifiers, or other information can be stored or accessed on your device for the purposes presented to you. Ads can be shown to you based on the content you're viewing, the app you're using, your approximate location, or your device type. Personalized ads can be shown to you based on a profile about you. Market research can be used to learn more about the audiences who visit sites, apps and view ads. Your device can receive and send information that allows you to see and interact with ads and content. Different devices can be determined as belonging to you or your household in support of one or more of purposes. Your device might be distinguished from other devices based on information it automatically sends, such as IP address or browser type. This post received a score of 8,000, with an upvote ratio of 97%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. Probably had as much to do with the fact that he's the deputy head of mobilization in Russia as he was responsible for missile strikes. Getting shot in the back in Russia speaks volumes. Yeah, this just begs for who shot him. Dying with curiosity, if you will winking face. Oh, oh, I've seen this one. It was Maggie Simpson. Spoilers. I mean, it was almost 30 years ago that episode aired. It would be like me giving away spoilers to the movie speed. The bus explodes but nobody was on it. Dude, not cool man. Question mark. Bruce Willis was dead the whole time in the sixth sense. In Fight Club, Tyler Durden is also the main protagonist, but he's inside his head. In The Passion of the Christ, Jesus dies at the end. Plot twist. He comes back. The terms of the new Wagner, put and deal. Good news. A position just opened. Do you want to be the Czech's notes director of mobilization? LPT, always ask why the position is open. What is the retention rate? Do you pay for OT? All Kremlin positions are salary, and while there is not paid overtime there will be ample opportunity for embezzlement. We have a greater than 95% retention rate over five years, and severance packages are handled by Mohammed bin Salman. The fact that we may never know which side killed him speaks volumes. There are clues we can use to find out. Was he shot in the back? Russia shot in the front? Ukraine. He was apparently shot in the back. By Buford Tannen, over a matter of $80? If his horse threw a shoe, that's his problem. Standard Russian politics, I assume? Mondays, am I right? Someone had a bad case of the Mondays. I believe you'd get your ass shot, saying something like that, man. Two chicks at one time. Oh, is Russia actually splintering apart now? It's sorely needed. See what happens when you stay away from windows. Turns out bullets are just as dangerous. Who knew? Only takes one window. Bullets are wannabes in Russia. Clearly he fell backwards onto a bullet. They really shouldn't leave those laying around on the ground. Oh no. What's everyone having for dinner? In and out. Those are good burgers, Walter. Jesse, it's time to cook. More of them. Everything from Russia feels like it's inside a pinball machine, with someone wildly tapping the flappers, with no real goal other than to see how long their turn can last. I can only wish him to boil well in hell if it exists. Oh well. That's one down. It'd be a shame for this to continue. Rest in pieces. I bomb in peace. Shame load shotgun. Another solid hit by Budinov's boys. Internal power struggle, disgruntled mobex, and hash X200B. Anyway, I'm having homemade burgers tonight. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.